today's video, I just want to show you my coin collection. These are the coins that I accumulated from 1982 to now, but mostly I accumulated these coins from about 1982 to, I guess, the 1990s. And I also traveled to different parts of the world as well, and I also got some coins as well. So, this is a I don't know what that is. This is a Canadian. It says 2000, 2006 on it. 25 cent Canadian. This is a 25 cent Canadian from 1977. As you can see. I have this one right here. I don't know what this is. Of the Netherlands I don't think they have money from the Netherlands anymore um, I think it's all called the euro now you don't have Deutschmarks you don't have um, coins like these from individual your Euro Western European countries this is from uh, 1975 as you can see from the Netherlands I have this as well this is called what this is I can't really see it very well it's just Caribbean or something don't know what this coin is I don't know where I got this coin from maybe someone gave it to me or something. I have this coin I think this is a, an image of Chiang Kai-shek this is probably from Taiwan or something as you can see this is a, I think this is a British one pence, I think that's one penny or something, 1961, as you can see. I think one of my friends gave me this. This is, I don't know what this is. This is from... The People's Republic of China, 1997. It says, Xiong Ha Ren Gong Ha Okay, I don't know. Okay, that's. Yes, this is from the People's Republic of China. This is one yuan. Let's see what this is. This is a peso. I think this is from Mexico. I think one of my friends gave me this in elementary school or something. This is from Mexico. This, whoops, whoopsie daisy. This is two pence. I think it's a UK coin. 19... Let me see that. I can't see very well. It says 1986 on here. Two pence. This is ten pence. I think this is like ten cents or something. Yeah, one of my friends gave me this. What year? Let me see what year. This is 1975, ten pence. This is a Canadian coin from 2008. I don't know, maybe this is a nickel or something. Let's see what this is. This is also Canadian. This is Alberta. 1992, I think that's a nickel Canadian. A lot of Canadian coins. This is 50 yen. I think this is from Japan. Another Canadian 25 cents from 1969. Got a lot of Canadian coins. Let's see what this is. 
I think this is from Germany. Let's see what that is, I can't see. This is Bundesrepublik Deutschland or something. This must be from West Germany. Try to see. Nineteen seventy-seven. If anybody knows what this coin is, tell me, because I don't know. I've never been to Germany, but somebody somebody must have given it to me. This is one Deutschmark. 1954, 55, 50, I can't see. Sorry, my vision's not that good. 1958, one Deutschmark from West Germany. Twenty-five cent Canadian, I think. Nineteen ninety-nine. Okay. I think this is five hundred won or something. Nineteen ninety-four. This is a South Korean coin. This is one hundred won from nineteen seventy-seven. Another South Korean coin. This is a bus token. <laughs> I don't know where I got that from. I, I never went on a bus, but there I have it. This is one franc. They don't use francs anymore. They use euros. So this is a coin that you cannot use anymore. Let's see what year it is. I gotta look at it in the light because my eyes, when you reach your late 40s, your eyes get bad. 1974. One franc. I think this is from Spain or something. It's worn out pretty good. Really can't see very much. It says, how do you say 10 in Spanish? Diez centavos. No, this is from El Salvador. This is El Salvador. What's this? This looks like Russian or something. It's in Cyrillic. Can't read Russian. I don't know. It says 2007 on it. If anybody knows what this is, please put it down in the comment section below so I know what that is. What is that? Two rubles or something? I can't read Cyrillic, so I don't know. You're, you're going to have to tell me. Another one franc. I did this already. I think this is 50 yen from Japan. Let's see what year it is. from I guess United Kingdom 1992 or something I did go to the United Kingdom before but that, that was 2012 so I, I don't think I could have gotten that coin but when I went that time I did not save any of the money. I just converted it all back to the currency that I use. I have no idea what that is, what that coin is. Let me look at it. Oh, this is Italian. This is 1990. 
nine or something. I don't know where I got that from. I never went to Italy. I used to have a maybe 1990 or something. I think it's Italian coin or something like that. One franc. It's a French coin. So it's actually Belgium, Belgian, Belgium, 1995. Not exactly sure when the euro came into being, but it was before the euro came into existence, I think. I think this is another Korean coin. This is South Korean coin, 2005. This is 10 won. Another Canadian coin, 2005, 25 cents. And this, I don't know, this is a Israeli coin. I don't know how I got this. Maybe when I was doing my brick and mortar business, I got a lot of foreign coins like this. People would hand me coins and they weren't US coins, so I must have gotten, it, gotten a lot of these coins like that as well. When I was running a brick and mortar business, I also have these coins. I think these are called copper cash. They were used in the Far East for hundreds of years, maybe during the Song Dynasty, the Ming Dynasty, and other dynasties. And all over East Asia, really. I have a whole bunch of these as well. As you can see, there's a Chinese character. Some of them are pretty badly corroded. I really can't make it out. I also have, um, I collect old pennies as well. This is a Canadian penny from 1980. Let me check. Nineteen fifty eight. So, doesn't doesn't I don't think there's any copper in it. This is a penny from 2010, the one on the right. This is a penny from 1941. I think it's called a wheat penny. I collect these. Throughout the years, I just, I just collected them, that's all. I hope you found it interesting. If you have any thoughts or questions, you could leave it in the comment section below and tell me about what some of these coins are because I don't know. And thank you for watching.